Hi guys, this is your sister Carrie Ann in Jesus Christ. Okay, brothers and sisters, um, I want to come to you and I want to do this video. It's a revelation. I've done it before. I've done uh, this revelation before, but it was all a little bit mixed up. So I want to come and make it crystal clear. Okay, so that when this thing begins to happen, you know, you can, by the grace of God, reference back to this video of what is to come. Now, I've done a video concerning the wicked device, all right, which is the three sixes. And brothers and sisters, the Pentagon, the Pentagon in the United States of America, they have got the three sixes. Let me just make that very, very, very clear crystal clear that they have now got the three sixes they have a device that can um pick up and counteract you know what it can also pick up and counteract cancers some form some hiv some uh, sexual diseases heart attack diabetes this is a little microchip in the skin and I've done videos, I think I've done two videos where I say that the you know what, brothers and sisters, will be eventually filtered out. We'll have a tiny small window. I think a lot of people are going to jump for joy when the wicked pharaohs of this world come, you know, internationally, radio, TV, social media, and begin to tell the people that, you know, we're going to stop. Because they're going to just lie. They're going to say we're going to stop the you know what. No more you know what. And a lot of people are going to believe and think, oh, yes, this is it. <laughs> back to normality. Brothers and sisters, there is no normality to go back to. The only normality is in Christ Jesus. Hallelujah. That is the only normality. And when the wicked pharaohs of this earth comes and say, you know, we're now stopping the you know what, no more of that. People are going to have a very small window because they're going to come back whether it's going to be six months down the line, a year down the line. I don't know. But these wicked pharaohs of the earth are going to come back and they're going to say, but <laughs> Jesus, Lord. they're going to come back and they're going to say, but we have a device that is more efficient, that is more better, that is more effective, that's got good efficacy, all right, that will literally, and they're going to lie, that will literally kill the you-know-what. You will never, ever get no more you-know-what. It's going to filter out cancer. It's going to kill all the cancer cells. Brothers and sisters, let me make this very, 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 very clear. When they come, and they say this to you, that this is the new device, that this device got medication in it and all of that. <sighs> Listen to the sound of Carrie and Giddens' voice. Under no circumstances, under no circumstances, even if you're at death's door, even if you've got a poorly child, a poorly, very sick family member and they're saying oh this device is gonna heal them under no circumstances do you or your family take this thing this is the three sixes of revelation 13 if you take this in your right hand and they're gonna say right hand because the bible does not lie the word of yah doesn't lie they're going to say right hand, okay? We know that some people through accident, some people are not born with arms. So they're going to say forehead, all right? This little chippy device is going to go in. If you ever, 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 ever take that, you are done for. Hell is your destination. There's no coming back to Jesus Christ of Nazareth and all the wicked um, side effects that's going to come with this thing. You're going to seek death and you're not going to be able to die. This is how this thing is going to be. This is Satan's final, final stamp on humanity. So I know, brothers and sisters, I know that the Pentagon has got it. It is here. The three sixes, the mark of the beast, it is here. It is at the Pentagon. 
So like I say, they are going to 150 million percent. They're going to filter out and they're going to stop the you know what that's going around right now. They're going to stop the way how it's administered. They're going to stop it. And they're going to give it through that little tiny rice grain. But when that day comes, brothers and sisters, please, I cannot beg you enough. Do not, do not, do not even go and take it. This is a time when you will have to make a decision eventually, okay? Because this is going to become absolutely 150% mandatory. There's no if, buts, or maybe. Right now, what do you know what, what's going on? You can dodge and dodge and duck and, you know, still live a so-called normal life. You still can go to the shops and whatever, what of you, what of you, what of you. You still can do certain things. But when the three sixes come in through the, the tiny wicked rice grain device, tiny wicked rice grain device that's going to be inserted in your right hand or forehead, there's no ducking and diving. It is going to be a choice. It is going to be a choice. You're not going to be forced. Let me make that clear because if you're forced, you cannot go to hell. Because then you have a, an argument for the Most High Yah on the day of judgment. And you can say to the Lord, well, Father God, they force me. When someone forces you, it means that they hold you down and give it to you. That's not going to happen with this. This is going to be a choice. And they're going to give you two choices. You either suffer for not taking the rice grain device. Or you take it. That's going to be your choice. It's going to be a choice, brothers and sisters. It is coming. It is not far off. This thing, it is, this is the reason why I said the Antichrist is not far from coming. Because he's got to be in power anyway to really administer the, um, the three sixes. Because... How are you going to worship the beast? How are you going to worship the image? How are you going to worship the number of the beast? How? And he's not even on the scene. It's impossible. He needs to come. Revelation 13. Revelation 13 tells you, and this is the reason why I say to brothers and sisters, I know some of you are saying, oh, do you know what? That is it. That's the mark. It is not. It is very, very wicked and you must not take it. It is a foreshadow. It's a, fore, it's a foreshadow of what is to come. But it is not the, it is not the three sixes. It is not the image of the beast. It is not the, the number of the beast. It is a foreshadow. But I am telling you, brothers and sisters, with no shadow of a doubt, there's no if, but, or maybe. I am telling you the Pentagon, they have got the mark of the beast it's just not ready to be implemented yet it's there it's in the pentagon and when they begin to filter out you know what then you're going to know all oh, days oh my days we are so close but like i say brothers and sisters when this thing comes into full force full effect you must not take it it, it all this that's going on is is trials it is a trial all right, this is a trial for you to understand what time it is. Yah is still merciful. Because I'm telling you, if this was the mark of the beast, image of the beast, worshipping the devil and all of that, if this thing that's going on, the you know what, if this was a three sixes, you wouldn't be able to live with your family members. No way. Because they are literally Satan. You wouldn't be able to live with them. Many, 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 many of our family members, many of our friends, people that we know have taken the you, you know, the you know what. Are you still around them? Your husband is taking it. You still sleep with them. Your wife will take it. You're still with them. Your kids, you still hug and love them because it is not the three sixes. It's not brothers and sisters. It's not. All right. So you can obviously still carry on. Be a normal family, but you know in your heart that, okay, they shouldn't have, do you know what? 
you know, you, they, they shouldn't have done it. But that's their choice. They've made that choice. But it is not the three sixes. So don't go, go around hating your family and friends and what have you because they have got the you know what. Don't do it. Because it's, it's you know, it's not the mark. Because once you have the mark, brothers and sisters, your mind and your heart will change. You, you won't love God the same way. I'm not, you know, I know people are saying, oh, you know, I've taken some people have got to the you know what and they feel that the absence of the Most High Yah has gone and all of that. Well, you know, maybe that's just could be a little bit of guilt that's going on. Um, but the real complete blockage of Christ out of your heart, that is going to come through the, the tiny rice grain device in your right hand or forehead. That's when Yah is going to be completely blocked out. The only person that you're going to worship is Lucifer, is Satan. This thing is really, it is coming. It is just down the street, brothers and sisters. And like I say, it is not going to be forced. When they implement this thing all over the world, it is not going to be forced. It will be a choice. It will be a choice. And the reason why it's going to be a choice because when they're going to... Thank you, Lord. Yes. Thank you, Lord. When they're going to... When they are ready to implement the three sixes, um, I'm going to call it the tiny rice grain device. When they're ready to implement the tiny rice grain device via right hand in your right hand or your forehead or 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 worshiping satan or worshiping the image the, the, the number of his name they're going to explain it to you this is the reason why it's going to be a choice they're not just going to come and say oh this is it you know they're, go they're going to explain it they're not going to lie they're going to tell you exactly what it is for and one of the things that they're going to tell you, brothers and sisters, this is how wicked this thing is. When it comes to the religious, when it comes, thank you, Lord, as I'm speaking to you, the Most High Yah is downloading in my heart what to say. When it comes to the religious aspect of the, of the, um, when it comes to the religious aspect of the tiny rice grain device, one of the things they're going to tell you, you they're going to lie. But they're gonna, the, it's a truth they're telling you, but for us it's a lie. All right. And one of the, um, one of the religious aspects of the tiny rice grain device in your right hand or forehead is that they're gonna say to you, once you get this, it's gonna connect you straight to God. But wish God. <laughs> They're going to say it's going to connect you straight to God. They're going to tell you that, you know, it's for everybody to worship the same God. And without this rice grain device, you cannot, you cannot worship the same God. That's what they're going to tell you. That is where the religious aspect, this is what I'm saying. It's going to be a choice. They're not just, like I said, I know, I know I'm repeating myself. They're not just going to come with this rice grain and say, here you go, take it, or we're going to get rid of you. No, they're going to explain it to you, and then you're going to make a choice. So like I said, with the, the, with the financial bit, that's easy to explain, because they're going to say, look, we're not having any money, uh, monetary, no more paper money, no more coins, no more credit cards. They're going to explain that to you. All right? Um... And then with the medical bit, they're gonna even they're gonna explain that to you. Oh, it's very good. It can wipe out cancer. It can heal diabetes. You won't feel sick anymore. They're gonna explain that to you. And then when it comes to re the religious part, that's gonna get you into the lake of fire. They're gonna say to you, this device will connect you to 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 to. Well, it's their false god. It's Satan, really. But they're gonna say to you, look, this device is to connect you to. God and everybody needs to worship the same God. That's what they're going to say. 
They're going to say everyone in this world needs to be worshipping. It's called the one world religion. That's why it's called one, 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 one world religion. Because they need everybody to worship Lucifer. It's one mind. Just like the ten kings of Revelation who gave power to the beast for one hour. They all have the same mind. That's going to happen to the people of this world who take this 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 um this rice grain device. All right. So they're gonna tell you the truth, but we know that they're lying. And they go. This is where, like I said, this is where the religious aspect the the religious aspect is gonna come in. They're gonna say they want you to worship one God. Everybody in the world has to worship one God. Now, when they say that to you, you're gonna make a choice. That's it. You will, you will have to make a choice. You're either going to say, you know what? It sounds really good. Yeah, it sounds good. We can all worship God. <laughs> the one God, finally. Finally, one God we're worshiping. But you know that's Satan. They're not going to tell you it's Satan. But because you know that it's a lie. You know who Yah, the real Yah is. You know that you don't need any device to worship Yah. You don't need any implementation of rice grain device inside of your body to be connected to the true uncreated God. You know that's a lie. So if you believe that lie and fall for that lie and take in that lie, you have made that choice because on the day of judgment, you will be judged. You've got no excuse. What are you going to say to the Lord? Well, they told me that I can get close to you. But you know the truth. You know that you only get close to Yah through Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Not a device. It's coming. It's going to be a choice. It is, it's around the corner. We are warning, brothers and sisters. So this device is ready. It is ready. It is ready. It is ready. Prepare yourself for the wicked pharaohs of this world to soon come out and say, we are getting rid of the you know what, how we give it to the people. We're going to use it through the rice grain, the, the tiny rice grain device in the hand or the forehead. And, you know, as I said, it's going to be a, a, a correlation because the, the beast, the Antichrist will be in power when this is happening. He's not far off. It looks like he's far away, but this Antichrist, yeah, not far off, brothers and sisters. So I wanted to come and do this video just to explain one more time about the wicked device and that the Pentagon, the Pentagon has got it. It is ready. It is ready. Don't take it. Do not take it by any means or anything. Do not take this thing. All right? So be bold, be strong, be courageous. Walk with Yah just like Enoch. All praises, all beautiful praises to the Most High Yah who lives above the heavens. Yah eternal bless you. I love you all and I will see you soon, someday in glory. In Jesus Christ's precious name, amen and amen, amen. Let us say the benediction. I beg your pardon. Let us say the benediction together. It is Jude chapter 1. That's Jude chapter 1 verses 24 to 25. We agree and stand with the servant of the Most High, Yah, Brother Jude, how he expresses how beautiful our uncreated Yah is. Hallelujah. And the Bible reads, Now unto him that is able to keep you from falling and to present you faultless, before the presence of his glory with exceeding joy to the only wise God our Savior be glory and majesty dominion and power both now and forever amen and amen amen blessings amen